Hola guys, welcome to the first video of my channel. I decided to make a video stating my opinions on stuff of the BL world because no opinion is unpopular at this point and I am a dramatic bitch. Let's get started. Number 1, in every level except pacing, 2 moons 2 was better. Oh if I say this because season 1 was slow as fuck and season 2 was too fast paced and if I have to choose I would prefer slow because it allows to have a better grasp of the characters feelings and journey. I was not surprised though, when they said they were gonna resume season 1 in 3 episodes I knew they were gonna rush some things and I do agree it was necessary. It ended up being an amazing series like I expected it to be so no complaints. Dot number 3. Kimon deserves more. He is one of the funniest people out there, he is a great actor, entertainer and MC, there's not a single dull moment when he's on a video and I sincerely hope he gets more love for the new series he is gonna appear in, I hope it showcases his skills to the fullest and brings him more fans. Not to mention, he's the best leader SB5 could have. Seriously, just stan him. Number 4, Hotel Stars the series looks good. I've seen many saying it looks boring and are disappointed it will not have as much BL but I'm actually excited to see it. My favorite type of BLs are those that show a great love story behind the crazy ride that is life, is more realistic. They will fight for a job position, it wouldn't make a lot of sense for them to have romantic scenes all the time, I like the adult theme. High school and college series are fun but is nice to vary. Number 5, Taiwan is really fighting to have better BLS than Thailand and they might win. The truth is Taiwanese BLS couples have amazing chemistry, amazing storyline, great writing etc. Maybe is because they have less series so obviously they look better but they prioritize quality over quantity while Thailand is the contrary. Thailand is still ahead because Sodas and Two Moons were the series that got the most fans involved in this scene and they invest and promote this type of series really well. Thai series appear cuter and appeal to young people and once Taiwan starts doing that, they will be on the same level or maybe higher. Number 6, Y'all Really Need To Stop Romantizing Rape while watching Love by Chance I saw the spoiler that Techno and Kengla were gonna end up together and I was super excited to see how that was gonna happen. Just imagine my disappointment when I see how it starts Sigh, I was incredibly sad because the actor that played Kengla became my favorite on the day I saw him, his looks were my favorite, his acting was great and they had to ruin it with that shitty excuse of a love story. That was just lazy writing and offensive to rape victims. Number 7, I don't like when pairs overdo fan service. At the beginning, I understand that being necessary for them to get closer and get a fan base, but after a while, overdoing it by forcing themselves to touch each other when they don't have to or smile at the other when is clearly forced is just boring. Is all preferences, many like that and that's fine but my favorite type of ships are those that enjoy hanging out and and don't post anything on social media even though they're together, some examples being Ben Earth, Kim Cop, Tanyo, Ofcon and more. That is all for this video. If you agree or disagree with any of what I said, comment down below, keep it respectful and civil please. Thanks for watching. Adas.